Silver Stacks Prepper, man, back at you again, man. Another one of these live uh, ride and talk videos. Just decided to get out and about today, man. Um, hit the grocery store, as you can see, as always. Um, I got my go bag with me, as usual. Listening to the scanner, always. Always trying to stay updated with what's going on in the community <clears throat> in my local counties. If you guys get you one of these uh, little Baofeng, I think this UV5R, UVR5, UV5R, it only like 25, 30 bucks on Amazon, eBay. Plenty of YouTube videos out there to tell you how to program them. You can look up your local county uh, scanner frequencies uh, to find out your local police department, county sheriffs, all that type of stuff. You can get the frequencies for all that. Um, yeah, so today I'm just uh, I'm just riding in my area, man. I heard a shooting a minute ago in the street called M. Um, somebody rode by in a black car, pulled the gun out the window, scared a bunch of a bunch of kids and, and some adults. And somebody was having a party or something. But uh, yeah, that's kind of that's kind of how it go, right? And I ain't even in the city. Drills and so every now and then to just throw my uh, my go back in the back seat. And just get smashed, it, man, and just try to get out here and see my best route. We had a flood not too long ago. I was able to kind of just get out here in the mix when everybody's panicking and just try to see who's who's uh you know what streets are gonna be closed under what type of circumstances. And, but you never can tell that type of stuff. You just got to get out here and just think about your plan. You know, it's like. Um, you know, if you you uh, worked in companies or managed companies, you know you got to do a fire drills every three months. Fire marshal got to come through and inspect. The building has to be prepared. The job has to be prepared for emergencies. No different with people, right? A family's a business. A family's a, a system of processes and management. And you got to be able to have uh, plans in place for when things happen. Stack your ample amount of silver and gold, some sort of precious metals. Um, keep you one of them paracord bracelets and some gold, something like that on your hand to be able to barter with, trade with, start a fire. Think about what you're going to start a fire with. Hey, a good dude to watch is Canadian Prepper. Canadian Prepper got a good, um, he got a pretty solid channel. Um, he sells uh, Prepper items as well, but a little too expensive for me. Um, you can get a lot of these things at uh, Harbor Freight Tools or on eBay or something like that. Like multi-purpose tools, multi-tools, um, that type of stuff. But, uh, water filtration systems, system, Amazon got that type of stuff for like eight or nine bucks, $10. You can get a, a water bladder. Yeah, so Canadian Prepper, he'll tell you how to build you a go bag. It's another guy I just kind of started watching. Um, so this is my latest go bag. I already got a go bag. But this is my latest go bag, and I'm kind of starting from scratch. Um, as I buy new pieces and new components, I take the older stuff out, kind of just cycle through my go items. More than likely, though, I'm a... Um, I'm going to stay in. I ain't going to bug out. Bug out is kind of the last resort. But you want to be ready. I mean, all situations aren't going to allow you to, to bug in. You may need to just dip out. Yeah, you know, uh, you get a paycheck, take you 50 bucks, go buy you some silver. So you can have something to barter with, trade with. If you got a truck, be like me, keep your gas can in the back. 
Make sure you got the basic items. Some water, water bottles. Get something for the weather. Something to sleep on, sleep in, and something to sleep under. The three sleeps. In, on, and under. Need you a little sleeping bag. They got them pretty cheap too. Make sure you get you a little sleeping bag. A little bivy, little shelter. B-I-V-Y. Those of you that don't know how I how I said that or how that's pronounced. Bivy. Get you a bivy. Little sack, little shelter. And just be ready, man. Keep your family with some comms. Keep a backup. Keep your comms. But yeah, I just decided to get out and about, man, and just enjoy. Uh, Welcome home again. A little ride in the countryside. Right now, I'm listening to uh, the county sheriff department scanner frequencies. Like I said, it was just a dude. A car full of people pulled out some guns on some people a minute ago. So it's always something happening. You know, a lot of people don't even realize all these things are really happening right under their nose, right in their local community. Um, if you get to a scanner and a little ham radio, you'd be able to hear all that stuff. You'd be able to know what's happening before the news know what's happening. It's spontaneous. I definitely recommend a scanner. Like I say, once again, Baofeng. UV5R, what's going on, 99? How you doing, my friend? Hope all is well with you, man. I be liking them guns you got over there on that side, man, on the channel, man. Put a link to your page in the... Um, in the comments so people can uh come check out your your material you want to check out some cool guns check out 99 fabrication you got some cool stuff over there i think he is smith i wouldn't mind getting into some dealing uh in some guns hopefully uh soon i'll know a little bit more or something about something like that Depends on how a couple things go. I'm waiting on a couple things. I may start showing some guns uh, on my channel, talking about some guns, assault weapons, that type of stuff. Yeah, sorry the channel just didn't turn out to be all about silver. Um, but I mean, man, you know, I'm Silver Stacks Prepper, so I done already showed the stacks. Showed a few prepper videos, but uh, I think it's gonna be more about prepping. I did some cannon. I learned learned to learned a little bit about some cannon. I think that was kind of cool, cool little little skill to learn. But now I want to do some dehydration, so I, I might do that. Keep you some seeds stacked up. Oh, come on, make it first. Yeah, sorry, yeah, I'm just trying to hear what happened with that, uh, with the people with that gun. Copy. Put the gun out on them kids and that little family, but, uh, um, yeah, man, it's just my little Sunday drive. Just getting out here, man, you know, just, uh, being in contact with the people. Hey, don't care what people say, man, just get you a go bag ready. I mean, that's the basic stuff. You can go to the dollar store, get you a screwdriver, a little, uh, box cutter. Just start with little stuff like that, man. Little stuff you might need to survive. Little pack of seeds. Get you a full pack of seeds from the dollar store. You never know, man. Push come to shove, you can just eat grass. You know, you can just eat grass. 
leaves on trees. Yeah, I'm out here in Whatcom County uh, in Washington State, y'all. Patriot Island, where you at, man? I know you out there on that farm, man. Welcome, Molly. Can I live with your staff? I know you out there on the farm, man. Email you know me some pictures, man, about uh email you know me some pictures with your uh with what you growing, man. Let me see what the chat's talking about. I like them lever actions too. Uh, the, the rifle man. I used to think when I was watching him, I thought he was a bad mother. Hush your mouth. <laughs> I, I thought he was a bad man. But that rifle man wasn't no joke, huh? Yeah, what's up with you, man? We gonna do some lives, man. I know I ain't got that many followers, man, and people and all that, but. You know, I don't always got time to prepare content, man. And so it's just about getting on here, man, and just chopping it up with the small little subscribers that I got. Touching bases. Sometimes I do got time for content, uh, you know, to make some content sometimes. But most times I don't, man. I'm really, really busy right now in my life, man. But uh, I don't want to let the channel go. And I want to stay up with the people. And I think I'm going to convert it. I'm going to end up. Making this about some gun. Patriot Allen, man, I knew that you was going to somehow get in on this live. What's the dealio, man? How you doing? I hope all is well with you and your family, man. I know you're talking about acquiring another, another piece of property or something like that. That's what's up. I wonder why my chat don't stay. Okay, there we go. And then it just disappeared. Man, I don't know what's up with the chat. Y'all hey, y'all know I don't know how to work this. <laughs> you, you, you know I don't know how to work this, man. I'm not... Uh, the guy that know how to do this. So I'm just here, man. I'm just here, man. Oh, happy birthday, Mr. Allen. Happy birthday, happy birthday. Yeah, I'm just riding and talking, man. I like to grab my go bag and throw it in the back of the truck and uh and just get up out of here man and go explore little roads and they got little uh logging roads and stuff like that man i like to go down them and you know experience the experience of being on the road i ain't never been on for all y'all that celebrate these holidays man happy holidays to you hope you enjoying good time with your family um I keep the high holy days of the most high. Like Feast of Trumpets, Feast of Trap Tabernacles, and Passover and all that. What y'all up to though, man? How's y'all Sunday going? Y'all got anything planned for tomorrow? Yeah, man, that gun content, man. I think I'm going to really start. Uh, I mean, the mini's cool. I like that macro. But I really like that uh, that 300 blackout. Um, shoot that 7.62. Uh, 
39 millimeters. I like them, man. I like them. I shoot. I like anything shoot 7.62s. Yeah, I was watching this one channel, man. This guy got a. Um, it's an AR-15. Uh, what did he call it? Uh, a rack. He called it a, a rack because it's an AR that shoot AK bullets. Um, so it's an AR-15, but it shoot. Uh, 7.62 uh, by 39 millimeters, man. I really like that gun, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I really like that one. But that 300 Blackout's a little heavy. The Draco's a little... Uh, a lot of people talk about the Draco, how loud they are. You know, it's not good for a home defense. Um, any 7.62 is really kind of not good at close range inside the house home defense. It's going to blow your ears out. you liable to be bleeding out your ears late night. And then you got to watch where you're shooting. It's going to go through the wall and, and hit your people sleeping in their rooms and that type of thing. So um, you're shooting something like a Draco or, you know, that 7.62 got that more of that, that bang, that stopping power than them. Uh... Yeah, so I've just been kind of looking at home defense, anything besides like a 9 or uh, but they do got them pistol carbine uh, guns. I like them too. I like them little pistol guns. Um, what, what you call them? PCCs? They shoot. Um, they got like Glock clips. They shoot nines. Um, I like them. I like them. I like them. I like them. I ain't really been into guns like that. It's been like an old school dude who just, you know, I'm going to shoot what shoot. But now I'm kind of starting to get into the. Um, Stuff I like more than other stuff. What's y'all favorite gun out there? Any suggestions on a good home defense that ain't gonna blow your ears out while you're trying to blow blow the intruder away? Any um, what you got, man? Any videos? Anything? Mention the team? Why? Why the damn? I put the chat, the 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 list of the chats up there, and it just disappeared. I got to keep hitting the button. That's crazy, man. Yeah, I hate that, man. Either YouTube changed their little system. Yeah, I like them Bulldog, them 357 Bulldogs, man. It, it pack a big, powerful punch, man. I mean, it'll blow a hole through a, through a, uh, through a cat's stomach, man. Chest cavity need one of them chest uh, close your womb kits. Yeah, it's always something happening, man, no matter what type uh, a place you live, whether it's a town, a city, no matter how big it is. There's always crime happening, man. I mean, I think every household need guns and a truck. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Every household need guns and a truck. Yeah, the AR-15's the shit, man. And 45, like anything, shoot 45s. Uh, I do. I used to have a Commando 45 with the hundred round drum. Looked like the old school Tommy guns. Al Capone and them used to shoot with. Um, Yeah, I like uh, I like that type of stuff, man. I, I love anything shoot a forty five. But yeah, that uh, commando I had. Oh yeah, no nah, man, thousand rounds. Yeah, that's cool. Um, but I want to press my own, man. I want to mold and press my own, man. Uh, I think I'm gonna start watching videos on that. I mean, I seen some videos a while back, which got me interested in it. But man, come on, man, making your own 7.62 bullets, man, Psst. fire, right? I mean, that's fire, man. You can't, uh, you can't beat that. You ain't gotta go to the store and buy nothing, man. Yeah, that 357 is the truth, man. Yeah, I don't like, I like that Bulldog, though. That, uh, Nick, I think it's nickel plated. Nickel plated, I, I, I had one before, but, yeah, that joint was a wrist kicker. 
<laughs> he he was a risk kicker for real, man. He was a risk kicker for real. But yeah, so just to be transparent, man, what's new to me? What's new to me is that damn uh, them PCCs, man. I think they call pistol carbine. Some pistol, some I don't know, man. Well, was two rifles in the 357. Hold on, wait a minute. What you saying? They got rifles that shoot 357s? Is that what I just saw? Sorry, man. I can't get to the chat. I'm finna pull over here in a minute, though. Did, did one of y'all just put a, 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 a comment up there about a rifle that shoot 357s? Did I hear that right? Two two rifles that shoot three fifty sevens. Yeah, I'm gonna have to pull over for this conversation. What? What's the name of it? Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Did you make a video on them? I'm gonna go have to go back and watch your videos. Um, go to your page, just type in 357 or something. I saw you had that revolver on there not too long ago. Yeah, I'm gonna have to get me a. Uh, I would love to have a, a rifle that shoots. Uh, and you said they lever actions. I would love to have a um, a rifle that shot 357s. Yeah, it's raining out here where I'm at, y'all. Henry Big Boy 357 and Rossi. Oh, that Rossi, that video you just made, wasn't that a rare one or something? Wasn't that Rossi a rare, uh, a rare gun? see if I can figure this damn chat thing out. Round capacity is an issue for most people with 347 miles. My goal, two, three revolvers, two rifles, and 357. <laughs> Thanks, Patriot. Yeah, man. Um, yeah, I had to pull over, man. Sorry, y'all. Yeah, I'm just reading the messages real quick. Yeah, I saw that uh that snub nose three fifty seven man. Home defense, yeah, home defense, yeah. So, but what you guys recommend though for home defense? Let's talk about that for a minute. The rare one was my Winchester eighteen ninety two. Yeah, for some reason I thought the Rossi was um was the uh was the rare one.
Who all in here, man? Leave a comment in the chat. Can we get them likes up? Let me get my uh, content back in the algorithm, man. Yeah, I'm going to have to come back and uh, check out your videos. Yeah, I was on your page the other day, Fabrication, man. And uh, I see you ain't posted in a while, man. I think the last video you had, um, Shotgun Springfield 45. Hey, Springfield, is that a, uh, what is that? Is that a handgun? It's not rare at all. It's more of a low. Okay, low end piece. Why did I think that was the one that you uh, that you had said was rare? Um, the Springfield forty five uh, Patriot is that a um, what is that? Is that a handgun or that's a that's a rifle, ain't it? Springfield. Why do I not know that? Yeah, handgun. Okay, okay, okay. Strange ass. What's up, man? What's the dealio? What's the dealio? How you been, man? Everything good? You in Australia, ain't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You won my first giveaway. Boy, it was expensive sending that thing over there to you, man. I hope all is well with you. We over here talking about guns right now. <clears throat> Hey, y'all, I want to recommend a good book. Not that I stand behind, um, you know, I'm damn, I'm not, uh, what they say, sponsored. I ain't sponsored by nobody um, or none of that type of stuff, man. But uh, this is a good book. He also got uh, another book called One Year After. Good prepper book, man. Make you think about some things. One second after and one year after. Okay, okay, okay. About the size of a Glock 17. Home defense AR pistol. There you go. There you go. What's up, LJ? He said he got the AR pistol. Yeah, 99, man. I would love to see. Um, <clears throat> I would love to watch that video, man. You're going to make me go home and look up. Uh, yeah, LJ, it has been a minute, my friend. It has been a minute. Yeah, 99, you're going to make me go home, man, and look at that. Uh, look up the uh, 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 the rifles that shoot the 357s, man. That's 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 kind of like my shit. Yeah, it's been a minute, man, LJ. I um Yeah, it's been a minute, man. I've been busy, man. You know, I bought a uh RV. Um I'm living on some land, renting a space on somebody's land here, man. And um Yeah, living on somebody's land, man. I'm just stacking money, man, and just doing my thing. Um, out the way, focusing on my prepping, um, focusing on, you know, I want 20 acres. I keep saying that, man. I've been saying that for a long time and they, it just hasn't, uh, presented itself. Um, but yeah, man, just been doing a lot of stuff with work, man, opening different little departments and stuff, man. Um, I started a nonprofit, um, in the city, in the city, man, I go to the little city, man, and I've been uh, feeding the homeless man and drug addicts and, I'm trying to start a needle exchange for people, man, to kind of keep down that Hep C and that HIV in the community. Um, hopefully it'll lead to a, um, yeah, hopefully it'll lead to me opening a center, uh, some sort of building or something like that, man. Um, as of now, you know, I'm the the uh, director of a, 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 well, clinical supervisor of a 32-bed um, inpatient treatment facility for serious mental illness and substance use. Uh, folks, um, I created pretty much from the uh, uh, from from the floor up, but uh, yeah, man. So that's what I do. But I'm looking to kind of just do something for myself. I've opened a few buildings, man, and it's like, man, you know, why don't I have my own by now? You know what I mean? I mean, you can look at the gray. You can see that I'm um, I'm handsome than than a mug, man. But I'm getting younger, man. You know what I'm saying? As the days go by, so as the days go by and I get younger, I start thinking ahead. 
um, like, man, why don't I have this myself? It's, it's been time for me to get something of my own. So, yeah, I'm trying to open up my own little spot um, for folks. I don't know whether it's going to be a 24 hour facility or just like a day drop in uh, center type of thing where we feed them and and uh, just trying to do my part for the community, man. I'm just trying to make a small difference in the community, man. I mean, you know, um, each one teach one, each one reach one. Um, I'm just trying to see the community in the world in a better place. Um, but while I'm doing that, I'm stacking up my silver, man. That ain't stopped stacking up my silver um, and trying to get these firearms together, trying to get these firearms together. Yeah, the city is crazy, man. I mean, even in the country, man, where I'm at. I mean, I stay listening to the uh, to the scanner, man. I mean, you know, it's always something happening. Yeah, I appreciate it, Patriot Island, man. Yeah, but them PCCs, man, I think it's called Pistol Carbine. I don't know. Somebody tell me the name of that stuff, man. Y'all know this stuff better than me, man. You know, y'all seem like y'all might be the gun fanatic people, man. I can't wait to uh, to get this thing, make this thing happen, man. Y'all know I'm an ex-felon, um, you know, did over 10 years in prison um, for selling drugs and, and, and having guns and that type of thing. So I've been having guns for decades, man, um, you know. Uh, but legally, I can't have them. So, uh, Pister Caliber Carbines. There we go, man. I knew somebody was going to help the game out. But, um, yeah, so I was uh, eligible under the New Hope Act out in Washington State to uh, wipe out all my felonies, man, and wipe out, uh, um, wipe clean my record completely, man. So, my whole record is going to be clean completely. It's already in the process in the courts. Uh, my lawyer's telling me everything should go through. Shouldn't be no problems. I qualify for sure um, to have everything clear. So as soon as that happens, um, I'm finna start buying uh, rifles like crazy, man. Um, you know, I don't know what they call in ARs and any of that no more. But to me, back then, AKs and ARs, uh, 80s, 90s, and 2000s was assault rifles, man. So I don't know what they calling it these days. But I like them PCCs, pistol caliber carbines, um, carbines. I'm really liking them, man. I'm really liking the ones that take them Glock clips. Um, yeah, so I don't know if it's if it's if it's nationwide, um, but I know Washington State. I know that for sure. Like they stopping. Um, oh yeah, 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 for sure. Um, uh, uh, I know that they stopped. They only finna start selling only ten round mags. Is that in every state or what? What is what is that about? Y'all school me, man. You know. Y'all need to do a live. One of y'all need to do a live. Let me watch y'all's live, man. School me. You know, I don't know, man. I'm a humble guy and humble enough to say I don't know everything, man. You know, I'm just trying to get in this game, man. But I know soon as uh soon as I'm able, he said all my federal rights, state rights, all my rights to be back here within uh less than 60 days. So it's been 30 already. So I'm waiting to, um for that to clear. And then I'm gonna see if I can get some sort of dealer's license, man. I would love to be Smith and Guns, man. That they say it's a gunsmith, gunsmithing um, school called Sonora Desert Institute or something like that, where they teach how to do all that stuff. Yeah, Patriot AKs and ARs. Yeah, there's one that's uh, damn it, I just said the name of it. I gotta look at it again. Iraq A R A K. It's an AR-15, but it shoots um. It shoots um, AK-47 bullets. So it's an AR-15 that shoots 7.62s. No, I know AR don't stand for assault rifle. <laughs> no, I'm saying growing up in LA, everything that uh, that that can shoot banana clips, we call it assault rifles, man. So I'm saying AR-15s was an assault rifle to us, you know, gang members growing up doing our thing. Um, AK-47s, M16s, all that type of stuff is what we call assault rifles, man. So <laughs> he said AR does not stand for assault rifle. <laughs> That was funny, man, but I did know that, man. I appreciate that. 
Um, he says in Ohio we can um, we can carry any number. He's rocking thirty round mags in his AR. Kentex Sub Two Thousand uses Glock mags, nine millimeter or forty. What? Glock what? Keltec Sub Two Thousand uses Glock. Yeah, for the nine millimeter or the forty, huh? So you know, I don't know. So, so a gun can shoot the nine millimeter and the forty caliber. That's crazy. Yeah, Patriot. What? So yeah, I'm gonna have to check out that SDI, man. Um, I was watching one of these channels, man, and they was talking about they was talking about that, man, and I was like, damn, man, I might as well just go ahead and get that once I get my rights back. I'm doing everything gun, man. Uh, everything, videos, all that. I'm making, doing it all. Hook up the furniture on it, make sure it's, it's doing good well, the way I need it to be, man. I can't wait to start testing the scopes and getting them dialed in and and uh, all that, man. I want silencers and everything, man. I don't, you know, um, I was talking to somebody in the guns. They were saying, you can't, you can't put, <laughs> they say you can't put, um, you can't use like no M203. You can't put no grenade launcher on them joints, man. With guns, so everybody that got gun, you know, gun rights, can we have grenades, man? Is that something that's that's that we can do or what? <laughs> yeah, well, I'm a Second Amendment person too, man. Uh, I, I they I just can't have none right now. You know what I mean? Um, but I can make sure everybody else around me got some, though. You know what I mean? That's that's kind of how it's been. He said, I got buddies that have grenade launchers um, if bought from the local gun shop. Yeah, man. I would love to have, uh, you know, put me one of them M203s on the bottom of something, man. Guy I was talking to out here was like, hey, they, uh, he wasn't a gun, you know, uh, a shop owner or nothing like that. But he was saying, yeah, just for aesthetics, you can kind of put them on there and just kind of for looks. Uh, I don't need no damn looks, man. You know, <laughs> the hell with some looks, man. I'm not in there. I look good enough right now, you know, especially on that side. Yeah, no, I'm being funny, man, y'all. But uh, yeah, no, I'm not into the looks, man. For real. Texas is a constitutional carry, absolutely unrestricted. Can have suppressors, binary triggers too. Uh, won't you be my neighbor? <laughs> I heard that, Mr. Rogers. <laughs> okay, so what's up with the binary triggers, man? What is, what is that about? Is that the one where it got the like the double, the little double click? It like click, then it clicks again. Is that what you're talking about? Or are you talking about two triggers? Man, I love this conversation, man. This that good shit. <laughs> yeah. Please won't you be my, my neighbor? <laughs> yeah, y'all right. Patriot, I see y'all is riding dirty, man. Y'all got grenade launchers and shit, man. Who would have known, man, when I started this live that this what this live would have turned to, man? Pops first round on pull and second round. Pops first round on pull and second round on release. So like a two round burst? Is that is that what this little tiny little brain can come up with is that is it like a two round burst with just the pull of the trigger is that what i'm hearing because shit pops first round on pull and second round on relief is that everywhere or is that just in texas lj double tap oh that's what they call a double tap okay okay Damn, I'm gonna have to move to Texas, man. Shit. <laughs> Texas, here I come, man. What the hell is going on, man? Y'all know I might need to come to Texas, man. Is I wonder, is that in Washington State too? 23 states are constitutional carries. Yeah, Washington State is an open carry state. It's real liberal, man. Um, I'm just glad I'm getting my rights back. 
yeah, I need that, man. I need that binary. Uh, yeah, ain't nothing. Uh, yeah, there we go, man. Here go the knowledge, man. Look at there. Y'all popping that game to a brother, man. Help a brother out. I just need to. So now I'm going to do some research on the uh, binary triggers, man, to see if this state is a state that uh, that actually has that. Yeah, if it is, I definitely need them. Yeah, I need that. And so it's three round bursts. Are those legal now, too, or what? Well, I mean, I know they don't make fully automatics no more. I know in some states. So I know some states you still can have fully automatics, right? In some states you can. Like, I wish they just make a blanket statement for for everything, man. Yeah, 308s is nice, man. I also seen... Um, Yeah, sixteen hundred yards. That's a nice. That's a nice distance. Um, so uh, yeah, I seen something that was like a. a I'm calling y'all. Don't don't beat me up. But I'm calling an assault rifle, um, or, or I should just say like a weapon that looks like an AR-15 and a 300 blackout and the AK and Draco. I seen a weapon like that that looked what I'm calling an assault rifle that shot 308s. It wasn't like a when I hear 308, I hear like uh like almost like a hunting rifle, like a sniper rifle, hunting rifle type of gun. Um is, is that like what you're talking about? 99? Man, don't be laughing at me, shit, man. <laughs> Be fucking, fucking laughing at me, man. Like I know what the hell I'm talking. You know I don't know what the hell I'm talking. About. I'm asking y'all. Shit, y'all go school. Little brother in the game, man. Let little brother get. Let me get in the game, boy. I tell you, man. I'm be buying guns left and right. Shit, cash me some silver in and get me some guns and bullets and quit playing, man. Quit playing. So the 308 is your 308 like a and I know there's a delay in the in the chats man in the messages. Yeah, I was looking at that uh that 300 blackout man. So it's like a sniper, but you just say precision. That's just like the terminology. I guess that sounds better than a sniper rifle, right? A sniper is like, you know, you just, I don't know, you're trying to secretly kill somebody or something, man. We ain't trying to do all that. Um, yeah, I was watching this dude. <clears throat> um, these two dudes, they, they, do like the top five this and that every week or, or once or twice a month or something talking about uh they each got a top five changes monthly or something whatever um and they was talking about one dude said um about the draco he was saying right yeah 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 about the about trying to kill somebody dude was talking about the draco he was like a lot of people talk bad about the draco uh and the hell pup the ak hell pup because he was saying, people were saying, uh, they get a lot of comments talking about, yeah, but you can't hit somebody at 200 yards. And he's like, yeah, you, you're you right. But if you hit somebody at 200 yards, you're going to jail. That's not home defense. You ain't, that ain't self-defense. You ain't, you know what I mean? Like, so you don't need something to hit somebody at 200 yards. Another good home defense pistol uh, is the judge. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, I seen one of them before. 
never touched it, never shot it or nothing like that. Just seen it, um, I think, on a video. Um, yeah, man. Yeah, I think I'm leaning more towards like a um, an AK type or AR-15. I'm saying trying to blow my eardrums out, man. And I done shot an AK plenty of times, man. Plenty, 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 plenty. Hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of times, man. Um, and them joints, they real distinct, man. You, But if you want that stopping power, man, that AK shells, man. Them, that, that AK ain't no joke. Anything 7.62 ain't no joke. I mean, I've had a SKSs with the little knife pokers on the end and shit, man. And uh, yeah, that's the Chinese made version. But um, yeah, man. Uh, so what is the AR less than sound? If I'm shooting the AR up close in the house, man, home defense, is that less? Is that going to bust my eardrums? I need to wake up and defend my house and grab my earplugs. AR, huh? Yeah, well, it's going to have to probably be uh, the 300 uh, blackout, man. For some reason, I was really liking that. Um, if not, then it'll probably just be one of them PCCs like that shoot uh, the nines or something, man. But I like the one he was talking about. What is it? Caltech that shoot the nines and the 40s? Yeah, I would. I would. I would. Uh, I think I would like that one. I'm going to check that out when I get back to the house, man. So the AR is quieter. Look, I got all these gun people in here. <laughs> it's a beautiful thing, man. Beautiful thing. Let me see who we got in here. LJ, say five people in here. But I only got four likes, man. Come on, let me get all the likes I can get. Let me get the channel back in the algorithm. Um, shotgun still best for close quarters of home defense. Won't go through many walls. I got the Glock 22. Can shoot 9 and 40. Just change the barrel. Keltech Sub 2000. What y'all think about the Scorpion, man? What you think about that Scorpion? That little, uh, the, I guess them assault rifles, too. The, ain't that a assault rifle, too, man? I don't know, man. I just like to shoot shit. Them just, like, motherfucker coming, I am just want to hit him. That's it. My aim is real good, too. Keltech Sub 2000. I will remember that. All right, we got six people in here. We got six likes, man. I'm really appreciating that. Thanks for the love. We're trying to get the Silver Stacks Prepper channel back into the algorithm. Um, hopefully, we got some new content coming soon. Um, Black Silver Staff. What's the dealio? Long time no see, man. How you been? Hope all is well with you and the fam. Yeah, that Scorpion, man. I was looking at a video on that, man. I like that Scorpion. Me, oh, man, I've been just busy, man. I've been doing stuff in the community, man, trying to, um, you know, open a, a, a new facility, uh, trying to figure out how to write for this grant. Uh, moved into an RV, uh, bought an RV, brand new 2022 off the floor, man, and just trying to get that little minimalist tiny house type life thing going, kind of, you know, trying to figure all that out. Um, finna get it prepared for the winter to make sure I don't bust no pipes. And, uh, yeah, just busy, man. Just busy. Just busy, man, with life. You know what I mean? Um, still stacking. Still stacking. Ain't no slacking in my stacking. Um, ain't nothing changed with that. But just finna try to veer the, the channel more towards prepper. Um, more towards that prepper side of things, man. I'm really digging that. So the so the gun uh, ranges do they do like background checks that type of thing? I gotta wait for this record to clear, man. They let you rent them, man. 
try out a ton of this thing as part of your research. Nothing like hands on. Yeah, man, I'm going to love to do that. I didn't know that, man. Yeah, I'm going to call the gun rangers, man, and find out, you know, what it takes. Can fold kill tech to fit in backpack mags interchange with Glock 22? So you need them both. You throw the right mask with both. Yeah, I like backpack guns, man. I like backpack guns, man. Say, I see we got seven people in here. Let me hit that that uh, that like button. Hit that subscribe. Um, I see we got seven likes. I mean, six likes. I'm trying to get. I'm trying to get as many as I can get to get the channel back into the algorithm, man. That'll really be a blessing for a brother, man. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell. I hate asking for that type of stuff, but um, yeah. Yeah, yeah, and and Patriot, I, like I wouldn't want it. Like I just want to, you know, let me see what see what it do. So yeah, I'm gonna give them a call, man, and see if we can, um, if I can get in there, man, and start playing with someone. Appreciate that, man. Appreciate that. Um, that like, whoever that seventh person is in here, man, that hit that like button, man. I'm trying to get this channel back in the algorithm. Um, I'll know in 30 days if I'm finna have the channel full of guns or not, man. And uh, so we'll be doing like gun reviews, hopefully. Um, I'll see how the channel's gonna morph into that. But uh yeah, I would love doing gun reviews. I've been watching some channels, man, that you know they buy guns and play with them and run about a thousand rounds through them, five hundred rounds through them, go sell the gun, buy another one to kind of play with the game. Um No, I'm not in Cali. I'm from LA. I'm born and raised in LA. But yeah, no, I'm not in Cali right now. I'm north of Seattle. Um, I'm up by um, uh, 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 by Canada, um, the furthest tip in of Washington State up by Canada, man. I'm like 10 minutes from Canada right now um, by Mount Baker. So, you know, I'm, I'm paranoid about uh, <clears throat> volcanoes and all that type of shit, man. I'm just trying to be ready for everything, man. You know, ain't no fear campaign, just a preparation campaign. You know, you fail to plan, you plan to fail. So I'm just trying to make sure that uh, I stay ready. Yeah, you in Texas? It's a couple y'all uh, out there in Texas. I think uh, LJ say he and Tay he in uh, uh, in the countryside of that Dallas over there, and uh, somebody else was in Texas. And well, and you for sure now, right? But somebody else was in uh, in Texas. So what y'all think about them uh, pistol caliber carbines, man? Carbines, beans, vines, tomatoes, tomatoes. What y'all think about them, man? Y'all think, uh, I mean, are they uh, uh, reliable? Right, better to have it not needed, man. I mean, I'm telling you, man, it's like American Express, man. I wouldn't leave home without it, you dig? Identify a gun dealer. You know, I was being funny when I first heard that. I thought you were saying I need to identify as a gun dealer. Uh, yeah, I, I identify as a gun dealer right now. So y'all got to respect that and just drop me off uh, a bunch of guns and use my gun pro now. I identify as a gun dealer for sure. Yeah, so they good and reliable, huh? What's the best um, in y'all's opinion? You know, my humble, my humble question. Um, what's the best PCC out there, man? What's the best most reliable pcc man is are any of them like the ak where you can drop it in the dirt and sand and mud and shoot and still just shoot what's up with you tight tight yeah that's what's up man good to see you man hit that like button hit that like button my brother i'm trying to get the channel back in the algorithm man i ain't been on in a while man and we trying to we trying to build the channel up. Hopefully, we finna start getting some guns and playing with some guns and things. Um, still got plenty of silver and all that, man. But I've just been busy um, doing my thing in this earth, man. Trying to make this earth a better place, man. You dig? I got a kid I'ma leave here, man. So I'm trying to just do my part in the community, man, to make the communities as healthy as possible. Um, Sometimes that might mean knocking one down or two. But um, yeah, hopefully, just trying to make the world a better place for me, man, uh, and my next generation, man. I appreciate the love, though, my brother. I appreciate the love. Ruger 9mm PCC is hardware reliable. Mine's been in the mud, the rain, and keeps cycling through. Ruger 9mm PCC. So what type of clips? Uh, LJ, is the silver? Uh, silver. Is the... Uh, <laughs> silver. <laughs> Might be time me to go buy some more. Is the... Um, what size clips is, is the Ruger? It's like 30 rounds, 10 rounds? I know here they said they starting to tell me we can limit to... 
like the AR order, assault rifle type guns to like 10 round mags, man. Yeah, 1911, them is nice. Oh, them is the Springfields. Ain't they? Ain't the 1911 Springfields? That's what uh, LJ or Patriot or somebody was talking about earlier. Turn this down. Why is your wife wrong? Round count depends on where you live. Yeah, that's 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 what I thought, man. Now, is that for PCCs and the rifles, or is that just is that for everything? You buy a thirty round man and fit on glue the rifles. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, man. But I don't know. I guess I gotta ask this lawyer, man, more questions about uh about the the mags. Yeah, I like the PCCs that take the Glock mags, man. Because they durable, man. You could drop them and beat them up. And yeah, they cool, man. Do anybody got any fully automatics? I mean, legal fully automatics. Don't tell your business, man. You know, them people is, them people is listening and them people is watching, man. This is the internet, man. Once it's out there, it's out there. So be careful with your response. But do anybody got any, uh, you know, say no. Uh, uh, <laughs> Anybody got any um <laughs> any fullies? Freedom Week, man. Y'all gonna have man, look. These guns, man. I'm loving these guns, man. This dude pulled up in a So nobody can have fullies no more? Is that what I'm hearing? There we go with this binary trigger. Come on man, y'all spoiling me, man. Y'all gonna get me started with this shit, man binary trigger man be looking at videos and shit all night about this shit binary trigger i got a new addiction <laughs> guns are gonna be my new addiction stay tuned i'm telling you man stay bet not give me my rights back man but they are and, and that's gonna happen so yeah the channel definitely gonna go with uh gonna go with some guns man They was? Damn. <laughs> well, glad I never got caught with none. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> with the fullies anyway. I got caught with some. I went to prison for guns, man. Um, Yeah, man. Delivery of, of uh, controlled substances, man. Um, You know, I was one of them guys sending out them big packs. Oh, yeah, yeah, Black Silver Staff. Yeah, no, I know somebody could hook it up uh, with some filing and some other stuff, man. I don't want I don't want none of that. I just got getting my rights back, man. I don't want to I don't, I don't want to lose them. <laughs> Shit, I don't want to lose them that fast, man. You trying to get my gun rights taken away. I'm just getting them back. Slow down, Tiger. Slow down, slow down, slow down, low down. Slow it down, man. I don't want nothing. If it ain't legal, uh-uh. Like Kevin Hart say, no, 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 no. I don't want none of that, man. None for me, player. Hold the pickets, lettuce, the pickles, lettuce, and tomatoes. I don't need none of that, man. No, no, no. Who we got new in here? We got somebody new in here. Hit that like button, man. Hit that like button. Hit that like button, man. I'm trying to get the algorithm back going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Especially on the channel 99. I know they're going to be watching, man. They, you know, they know my people, ex Black Panthers and ex gangs, and I'm ex gang and all that type of stuff. Ex felon, man, and gun toter and been caught with guns, went to prison for guns and drugs and, you know, all types of stuff. So I know they're watching my channel anyway. And anyway, so 
Yeah, we already know that. <laughs> right. Well, if then when that happens, I'm going to just, you know, we'll we have to just do it ourselves. But hey, look, I appreciate everybody. I ain't gone nowhere yet, but I'm just saying I appreciate everybody. We hitting the hour mark, man. And it ain't but just a few of us in here, man. And, and for us to be still going that long, man, I really appreciate it, man. I'm trying to get this algorithm back up, man, so I can start getting them views again, man. I, I only been getting just a few views since I stopped making the content. I see when you start making content, you get them thousand views and a few hundred views and you slow down, the algorithm slow down. So I think lives might be more where where I'm at, man. Yeah. Yeah, I, I'm really liking guns, man. I've been watching a lot of videos, man, doing a lot of reading. Any pointers? What's your best tip for uh new gun buyers what's your best tip anybody got any best tips Injuries, collision, two-year-old child, airbags deployed. Sad news, man. Yeah, it's always something going on, man. Make sure y'all get y'all a scanner, man. Get you a scanner. I got the long antenna going to the, the rooftop. And um, so that way I get the good reception. Yeah, safety first, man. I, um, you know, as I said, I grew up, grew, you know, shooting in the streets. So um, I know how to use them two hands. My aim is really good. Um, but yeah, I want to take like a gun safety class, that type of thing. I think that'd be cool. He said, just get out there and shoot some stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to have to, man. I'm going to have to. Y'all recommend any gun channels? And y'all been doing this obviously longer than me, uh, legally anyway. But, um, yeah, man, this is a ham radio. Get you a little uh, Baofeng UV5R um, ham radio, and and it had got a scanner in it. Um, you can program the scanner in it and all that, man. They're only like 25 bucks on Amazon, man. Get you a couple of them. The pack that they come in, open them up, line them with some foil. <sighs> so that way you build a little Faraday box for them and, um, you know, get you like a three or four of them keep you two put up that's only 25 30 bucks man that way you always hear what's going on man you got the weather channel you got everything get y'all a little watt fun 300 little solar little solar charger um little solar panels y'all know i got solar panels and the, the blue eddy ac 200p and um I had like a thousand watts of solar and two 200 amp hour uh, lithium iron phosphate batteries. And uh, yeah, so I'm good, man. The RV is good. I'm good. If shit happens, man, I just hooked that joint up to the truck. Nah, 25 for one. Now, what's this? Um, Coleon Nor, 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 Noir. How you say that? Ninety-nine. Is that the channel to watch that you recommend? Hickok forty-five, Black Silver Staff. What is that? Is that a channel you recommended? Coleon Nor. Ninety-nine. Colin Nor is good. Suge O O is a channel I watch. Yeah, I'm gonna get home. I'm gonna watch all of them. I'm gonna go to all of their channels. I'm gonna get all that. For sure. Oh, 
Okay, okay. Nor. Yeah. Sorry about that, y'all. I'm tired. I think I'm going to go home and get on the grill, man, and put me some. I came out here to this Safeway. Yeah, Hickok45 is an old white guy. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I think I'm going to go in this store, man, and, and maybe give me a steak or two, man. And You know, it's a little gloomy outside, man, a little rainy. Throw me a little steak or something on the, on the grill, man. Grill me a nice little steak, man. See what that steak going to taste like. Total nut. <laughs> He's a total gun nut. Hey, man, it's a dude. What's his dude name, man? Well, it's two A actors. Okay, okay. <sighs> um, it's a dude that's shooting an AK with bacon and ice cream. Have y'all seen that? He's on YouTube, crazy dude, man. They say he in prison now or something, man. One of my partners told me. Send me this damn link, man. This dude is fucking crazy, man. He got fucking bacon wrapped all in the damn... Th man, this dude's crazy, man. He fried an egg and bacon and dipped ice cream all on the, the chamber where the gun go, where the, the bullets come out, man, and had ice cream stuffed all in it. Just showing that the AK can just go through anything and still keep going. Dude is crazy, man. Bacon and ice cream. AK-47, something that, just look that up. AK-47 being shot with, egg, with with ice cream and bacon, man. The dude was nuts, man. But it worked. They say he went to prison for some old illegal shit, you know, obviously. Yeah. Oh, right, yeah. <sighs> Black Rambo. Yeah, I'm going to have to check that out. Yeah, I'm going to have to check them out, man. I appreciate y'all, man, for rocking with me, man. We will be back, man. We'll be doing it again. Um, I don't know how often I'm going to do it. I guess I'm going to try to do it every weekend. Um, yeah, we'll be doing something, man. I appreciate y'all, man, once again for rocking with me, man. Hit them notification bells. Um, I know everybody in there already hit the like button, so I appreciate that, man. I hope the channel's good. Y'all ought to rock with each other, man. Y'all go check out 99 Fabrication Channel, man. He got a cool channel, man. He got some guns and stuff over there. Um, what's up with that bug, man? That bus you got, man. What's up with that, man? You hip to them 21 windows? I know you hip to the 21 and 23 windows, man. You know them joints cause an arm and a leg and half a nut sack. What you gonna do with that Volkswagen bus? Yeah, man. I can't wait to feast on them steaks, man. I'm a fat boy. Gotta eat. Yeah, hey, man, I need y'all to stay healthy, man. I hit the gym about three, four times a week. Um, I wake up at 3.30 every day. Well, not every day. I wake up at 3.30, four days out the week, man. I go hit the gym and um, and get that iron in. I wear a bag, put a bag on like a poncho, and I get cracker like it, man. Good vi a good app to help y'all work out, count your calories and all that good stuff. It deal with the mental health, the physical health, the spiritual health, the workouts. It got the workouts for you all time. Better Me. It's called Better Me. It's a good app, man. A good app. A good app. Y'all trying to get healthy, be healthy, live healthy, act healthy, you know. Um, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I still got the RV. So I got rid of the old one that I had bought. Well, it wasn't too old. I mean, it was 2000 or something. But, yeah, I got rid of the one I had bought for 10 racks. Um, I sold that. Um, recoup some money pretty much kind of gave it away a little bit um, but yeah no I just bought a brand new one um, off the lot man a 2022 um, KZRV man uh, it's a 29 footer 29.8 something like that 29 footer sleeps they say 10 I would say 8 if you cram in there if not a good 6 for sure um yeah, but yeah, it's pretty cool, man. Um, I'm with that little tiny life right now, man. It's all right. It's working out all right for me, man. I'm loving it. I'm saving money, man. My rent, uh, the little land is six fifty. I'm good. 
It did. Yeah, I just can't wait to taste some of this little tangy little. Um, I got a video on here. It's a video on there. If you go back and scroll through and look at the videos, it's a video on here of it, man. It's brand new. I had just got it delivered. Um, but yeah, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. I can't wait, man. Y'all have a good, uh, a good evening, man. Patriot LJ 99, man. Black Silver Staff, man. And everybody that stopped through, I appreciate y'all. Have a good one, man. Stay tuned for next time. Um, until then, y'all stay blessed.